Hi there, it's Dawn Barnes. I'm a life and mindset coach for midlife mums. Let me ask you a question. As a mum, would you love to have more energy? And do you some days wake up and you can't wait for it to be bedtime again? <laughs> so how do you get more energy into your life as a busy working mother? And I'm not going to talk about diets or supplements or going to bed earlier, although all that stuff is really good and there's some fantastic information out there on the internet. But here's the thought, um, and it's been taking me back to a time when my sister lent me some tapes, um, cassette tapes, yes, <laughs> um, on stress management by the late and absolutely fantastic Roger Malott. And he had this um, theory called his pie theory. He talked about it a lot in, in these tapes. And that's all about energy. And this is my take on it. So when you're feeling mega stressed and overwhelmed with the amount of stuff that you've got going on at work, at home, and you're feeling exhausted by it all, and then on top of that, you start beating yourself up about, about it all, you haven't got it done and you're just feeling down about it. And then you have this negative self chatter going on and you're actually not talking to yourself in a very nice way. And what you perhaps maybe haven't considered is how much energy that takes when you're beating yourself up about it when things are kind of like out of your control you're just beating yourself up about it and just eliminating that helps enormously with your energy levels so here's the theory so every day when we wake up and we've got another chance of this game of life we all get given this pie so you get a pie for the day and it's your energy pie that you can use throughout your day. Now the thing is that our energy pie can be different sizes each day. So some days your, your pie is going to be huge and you're going to feel full of vitality sorry, and you're on fire and you're whizzing through that to-do to list, you're on it and you're just getting loads of stuff done. I love those days. And then on other days, your energy pie is so small, just getting up out of bed, having a shower, getting dressed seems to be all the energy you've got for the day. It's all taken up. Now, the good news is that you can get wise on how you spend your energy pie and be mindful not to waste it. Waste it on things that are out of control, out of your control or are just simply not worth spending your precious energy on. And if you've got an understanding that these things will eat away at your energy, it's just really helpful to just remember those things. And there's even better news. You can replenish your pie throughout the day. So how can you do this? So of course you can rest, but some days are gonna be busy and manic and it's just not possible to do so. You can eat healthily. Yes, there's tons of research on what you eat and what you put into your body affects your energy and your moods and, and more. And you can do other things that feed you. So I'm talking about what feeds your soul, what makes you happy and feel excited about life. So what are the things that make you happy? Where makes you happy? Who makes you happy? You know, when was the last time that you saw or you spoke to that friend who just gets you and they make you laugh and smile? You know, do the things that give you joy. And if you're not able to do it daily, then get them into your life regularly so you replenish that precious energy pie of yours. If you've forgotten, what are the things that you truly love to do because it's been such a long time since you've even thought about it, then start by spending a little bit of time just clearing your mind and write a list. Write a list of your top 10 things that make you happy and then keep your happy list close to you and make it a part of your life. Now, if you want further help, inspiration, guidance, then head on over to my website, dawn-barnes.com. Until next time, goodbye.